This is a series about love that doesn't involve seeking it outside of ourselves. We are whole. This series could also be called how to be in a romantic relationship with life. I've been putting more intentional time into romanticizing my relationship with life, honoring more pleasure play, quite literally hugging trees, feeling more samadhi, cosmic consciousness, and talking to them. This day I enjoyed the special cove of Griffith Park, quite an underrated and worthwhile visit. I tend to do the same paths, but if we always do the same thing, make routines of all of life, sometimes we miss the magic, the spontaneous choosing of a new path, quite literally, or a new experience that provides that. I looked back on videos of mine from this time last year, and I was a true wanderer. It was painful wandering Europe, Mexico, the world without the feeling of higher love, without a partner's reassurance, but being without helps us appreciate both. I now feel more held by the universe than ever before. As humans, I feel like we're a little predisposed to dissatisfaction, so sometimes the postponement of affection can help us really appreciate when we do have it too. That said, we don't have to postpone romance, ever. We can always make a romance of our lives itself, anytime.